Hey, hey, fella. I wonder where Benny ran off to. Hey, hey, welcome, welcome, welcome to the finest entertainment experience in New Vegas. My name is Tommy Torini. Well, it was my idea. Well, me and the rest of the Rad Pack boys. We took it to... A few years later, here we are. The best show in New Vegas. Well, apart from serving as a talent manager, show schedule, and all-around man in charge of... Every night from 8 till midnight, come on by to see the Rad Pack review. Well, acts are a bit thin on the ground right now, but every night from 8 to midnight... Songs, dancing, jokes... Sure, baby, sure. Tommy's always looking for new talent to bring to the Aces. Tell you what, you see any good acts while you... Just swing back by as you recruit folks. I'll get you your bread. Ooh, a shop customer. All right, all right. Five percent it is. I wonder where Benny... Hey, come on, pal. I'm trying to put on a show here. You're welcome. All right, then make it snappy, kid. This isn't exactly a lucrative career enterprise here. Yeah? Hey, you're all right. Tell him I'll do it for 100 a night. No, 50. No, 20. 10. Just don't rob me. I'll do it. Whoa, geez, what was I thinking? You're right. I had to go in there with a cool head. Tell them how much I'm really worth. have some real pull with house to get inside your leg. Whoa, baby. Am I looking at a mirror? Or are you just that ugly? Come on, stay in character. You're supposed to be heckling me. Hey, not bad. Your timing's terrible and you got no style. But you might make it as a professional heckler. What? You mean, you're not part of the act? Huh. Sorry. Thought you were the heckler Garrett hired to spice up the shows. Yeesh, is my act that bad? Or are you just that dumb? Yeah, that's right. Got me a nice juicy contract with the management. Okay, I admit it. I ain't exactly rowing in caps here. But what do you want? I'm under contract. I can't get out. Too bad I got this ironclad contract with the Garretts. They'll never... Huh. Good luck. Garretts a tough me... He's 38? You must... have some... real... real... Cool. with a... house... to get inside the lucky 38. So Benny went MIA, huh? I always fig. Now, why would I want to do that? His performances make me quite a lot of money. Well, I suppose you've got a point. Plenty of Brahmin on the prairie and all that. Fine, I'll cut him loose. Yep. How's it going? It's uh, great to be up here. Any luck with Garrett yet? Really? You mean I'm finally out of this shithole? That's great! Thank you! Howdy there, partner. 
My story's a long one, friend, and I can't say as it's all that interesting. Well, I was born in a little town out Montana way. Me and Ma didn't have much, ever since my pa up and left. That he did. Never did know why. Ma always said he was a real mysterious fella, even when he was with her. Like he was a stranger sometimes. Maybe. Maybe I just never felt like I belonged back home. It sure wasn't easy. Ma worked her fingers to the bone to make sure we had enough to survive. And I worked the coal mines from when I was 15. After Ma died, I guess I wanted to find my pa and get some answers from him. Been out here looking ever since, but he ain't an easy man to find. Can't say as I really know. Maybe I'll just ask him why. Maybe I'll punch him right in the mouth. Hell, the more I talk about it, the more the whole damn thing sounds like a dumb I... Maybe I should. Don't suppose you know any place a fella with a guitar might find a job, huh? Hmm, maybe it's time to give these tired old bones a rest. All right, show me... I suppose it's only right you get a little something for your trouble. Here, my daddy left me this gun. Guess I don't need it no more. Don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait, you... You don't work for Mr. Bishop, do you? Sorry, it's just... You look like his type, you know? You got that hard-ass wasteland explorer thing going on. Oh, so you have heard of me. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I was the big draw at the Shark Club. People used to pay hundreds of caps to see me. Really? The tops, huh? Well, it's no shark club, but I hear security on the strip is real tight. Even Mr. Bishop wouldn't hit a joint like that. I'll check it out. Thanks. Hey, hey, welcome. The cowboy act. Yeah. He dropped on here not too long before you. Before you. He's got chops, baby, real chops. And I ain't just talking about that mustache. And like we agreed, here's your...